What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Vontae, the first back again with another video. You already know the last chapter was crazy as fuck, man. My goat is back, I guess, temporarily, maybe, I guess. I don't think he's an illusion. A lot of people are saying that he was probably like an illusion. I don't think so, because if he was, I think Shinra would have been the one that thought about him, that kind of helped him out, motivated him and all that. And then we wouldn't have seen what we seen after he helped Shinra out, which was Arthur looking at the sword, looking at Excalibur. And we seen Excalibur from Soul Eater. So he manifested that soul within that sword. And he even said fool. So we definitely know it's from Soul Eater, which made a lot of us think that, hey man, maybe Fire Force truly is the prequel to Soul Eater. You know, that's been something that's been going on in the community for maybe about a year or even more than a year now. But especially within the last, like this last arc, people have been thinking about that a lot, especially seeing the moon and all this stuff. But man, that shit was crazy as fuck, man. It was definitely really crazy. So I'm thinking he's probably like, maybe like a ghost or something in between life and death. I think Arthur's some, somewhere in between that. I don't think he's necessarily an illusion though. And I don't really necessarily think he's alive. I would say he's somewhere in either between life and death or just a ghost in general, which is kind of like between life and death essentially. But yeah, um, we ended the chapter off with Shinra's mom. Shinra and Sho's mom came in. So Mary Kusakabe came in. She um, obviously is, is still in the demon form and whatnot. So I wonder what we're going to be seeing in this chapter. Uh, well, I kind of do know it's going to be like a backstory probably or seeing a flashback, I mean, of the family because it is called the Kuzakabe family. So I'm assuming we're going to see the Kuzakabe family back in the past. And then I don't know what, how the chapter is going to end, but let's see what's going to happen right now. Though. Let's get into it. Chapter 293, Fire Force. The promise he made as a child, he's been steadily running in order to fulfill it until now. The hero, Shinra. Of course, Kuzakabe family, it's a chapter title, we know that. Mother, brother, and little brother, happier days where we had everything we wanted. And you see Shinra reading a book and his mama cooking, you know what I'm saying? She in there whooping that shit, you know what I'm saying? And you see shows doing baby talk, I die, die, I bye. <laughs> Good morning, show. Uh, why? <laughs> Mom shows awake. And then it's about lunchtime. We'll eat in a minute. <laughs> and she look at that boy Shinra. He's like, Mom, I'm excited. He look at, I'm excited. I'm hungry. Can I help out with anything? Well, then I guess you can prepare the table. Let's do this. <laughs> that boy Shinra taking it serious, getting the plates and everything, the cups and the spoons ready. Nice job playing up the table. It looks good. Table for three. <laughs> But Sho can't eat regular food yet. And you can see the baba. You got the baba. <laughs> okay, pigeon, bottle, pigeon. It's a Japanese brand that makes baby products. Okay, that's good information, you know? <laughs> oh, shit, I got scared for a second. I was about to say, is that a fucking uh, bug? One of them goddamn Adola bugs or some shit? But that's just a dragonfly sticker or design on the bottle. <laughs> Let's eat. Lautom. They eating. Shira said, this shit good. Chew your food properly. It's so good. Shinra, thanks for always being here to help. I'll always keep mom and show safe since I'm a hero. That's damn right, boy. Today, a solar eclipse will occur at 5.07 p.m. where the sun god will temporarily be absent. We recommend that you stay coop cooped up in your homes and not go outside. Now for the next song. Hey, mom, what's a solar eclipse? It's when the sun gets covered, by, uh, covered up by the moon. The sun god is going to be gone for a little while, so let's stay home for today. That sounds like some trouble. Don't worry, show. <laughs> show crying and shit. And we're sure waiting for that mug. What's the matter, Mr. Shinra? <laughs> I'm keeping watch so <clears throat> I'm keeping watch so the solar eclipse doesn't make it in. Make make it in so you don't have to worry. The solar eclipse will happen later in the evening. Remember, don't tell me you're staying up until then. The hero doesn't go down without a fight. <laughs> I'm leaving it to you, Captain Shinra. Roger. <laughs> That boy waiting like, man, I'm waiting for that shit. Look, he falling asleep and shit, boy. Oh, she see this eye? What the hell is that? Is that like the eclipse starting already? Hmm. Shinra, it's time for a break, all right? That boy, he's, he, he already slumped on the ground and shit, comfortable and shit. <laughs> the solar eclipse will commence shortly. Ladies and gentlemen, please refrain from going out unnecessarily. Wah, wah, wah. That's, that's show crying. That's not, that's not me crying. That's... It's the boy show, you know what I'm saying? A little, little show, a little show jit, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> What's the matter? This holy eclipse sure is scary, huh? It's okay though, don't worry. They're there. Wah, wah, wah. Don't be afraid. They're there. He's still crying. Sharon puts on his cape and shit. He says, Show, he slipped, he tripped, he fell. It's fine, show. Shinra man's come to save the day. 
Shinra man is here. <laughs> she said, Psh, boy, <laughs> what are you doing, Shinra? Is Shinra man all right? <laughs> and they're laughing. <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> you see Sho laughing too a little bit. <laughs> You're safe now that Shinra man is here. Oh, and there go the Eclipse. And that motherfucker, yeah, that motherfucker look crazy. It's beautiful, right? She's holding both of them. They're both looking. Now we're going back to the present time. They're both... Well, Sho is crying because he's seeing all these memories. See, I, I like that. I like that detail because it just shows that it shows that Sho, you know, he didn't get to, you know, grow up with his mom. He didn't really get to know her at all. So it's like him always seeing these memories is always going to be emotional for him, especially for a kid. Anyway, that's like it's realistic, especially for a kid. I mean, for anybody, but definitely for a kid. He's only, what, 13 years old or something like that, 13, 14 years old. So it's like, of course, he's going to feel that, you know. So the hand we saw in our Dola link back in the nether was mom. Mm. Mom. And he's hugging it. Oh, wow. He got the show got to hug her, you know, when he's actually, you know, old enough to, you know, actually experience it. Even though this is not her form form, but this, you know, this is her demon form. But still, it's still mama, you know, she's still, um, you know, hugging them and all that. Mommy. <laughs> but now that the world has come to an end, why? He said that is the evangelist doppelganger. Um, so Shinra and Sho's mom, Mary Kusekabe, is the evangelist doppelganger. Um, okay, Mary is the evangelist doppelganger. The world may be dying, but as long as there are heroes, hope will never cease. To be continued in chapter 294, Despair versus Hope. Huh. Wow. This is interesting. I mean, I, I'm not going to say it don't make sense. Like, with, you know, me personally thinking back. Because, I mean, the fact that she was a virgin pregnancy and all that. And I guess the evangelist chose her to be the doppelganger and everything. I, wonder, I, I don't know if there's like a real reason why as to why. Or is it just like she just chose anybody who's pregnant or not pregnant, but she chose anybody to just get pregnant and do all that stuff. That's interesting, though. Wow. I don't know what to think about that. Like, so the evangel I want to see the evangelist, the, the evangelist's face. I feel like the evangelist is going to look similar to that. Um, what, what can I even call her? Okay, my bad. At the at the edit something out, you know what I'm saying? Somebody called me, you know what I'm saying? Anyway, uh, what I was talking about was the Chinese Peninsula. Um, when the lady, the I don't know what to refer to her. I guess she was like the first pillar, cause she did say she was like, yeah, in the first cataclysm. So with her, um, I wonder if she. I feel like the Avengers look similar to her. Maybe I don't know. Maybe something like that. That's interesting. That that. Shinra's mom, Shinra Sho's mom is the doppelganger of the, um, the, uh, evangelist. That's interesting. So I wonder if she has maybe the same kind of capabilities as her, you know? And I wonder why she created her own doppelganger. Like, was it, did she create that or did, she, or did it just, you know what I'm saying? Like, just, it was just random. Everybody has to have one and she just so happened to become one or something. I don't know. I really don't know. Let me know down below what you guys think about that. Like, if you guys can remember maybe something within the series that kind of told us ahead of time that she was a doppelganger, or not necessarily that, but like, where you guys can understand maybe how that was possible, or just the doppelgangers in general and explain it, because I don't know. I, I wouldn't have expected the evangelists to have one. Like, I wouldn't know if the evangelists would have created one or that, or it just, some, it just happened like that. That's interesting though. Cause then that means essentially that Shinra Sho's mom is the evangelist at that point, technically. You know, cause I mean, Mary Kusakabe, she was a real person. You know, her devil form or whatever, or demon form rather, isn't, but she's still her. You know, so it's like I wonder if, they, if she can help them, maybe re, like, you know, recover the world or make a new world. I don't know, man. I just, man, I just. I just can't wait for the next chapter. Every time I read Fire Force, because it's like, man, I just can't wait. I can't wait. I can't wait. But then again, you know, I don't want it to end either. But hey, man, that's everything got to end. But yeah, let me know down below what you guys thought about this chapter and my reaction, all that stuff. Explain some things to me if I got anything mixed up in this chapter from what I said. Anything, you know. 
um i'm excited for the next one so i'll see you guys in that one as well but stay tuned for all the other manga anime content that i have on the channel already like tokyo revengers pull up for all of that i'm gonna be live streaming that shit soon so yeah pull up for that but yeah um like i said in every video please like comment subscribe share the video please because about 80 percent of you guys that watch my videos on the regular have not subscribed yet so please subscribe please subscribe please i know i used to say you know you don't have to but please do it because i mean it just shows that you guys are engaged with the channel and that my channel is actually getting out there for people that probably might want to see my content and it's probably preventing them from seeing it because it's not out there you know so please subscribe like and do all that stuff and comment and yeah like i also say please stay safe stay healthy stay clean see you guys on the next video and peace